Okay. Hello, and welcome back to Dang... I should have written this fucking motherfucker down. So, yeah, we're getting back into it. We just got free time in the last episode. Uh, we talked with Sayaka. And she's uh, she's like, like high-key psycho, um, but low-key about being high-key psycho. And, uh, yeah, everyone else is just kind of chilling out. And I have a golden sword in my room now. We're gonna, it, it comes off on your hands when you, when you touch it. Uh, so that's going to be fucking useful for later. And, uh, yeah, we're going to fucking, we're going to go, they, they suggested that we go talk to Sayaka now. So we're going to go do that with our free time. Uh, I don't want to sleep. Lint roller. Mm -hmm. I think, I just want to see if anything new happens. Yeah, okay, it's, it's, it's just slightly new stuff. Let's check that waste bin, though. I don't see any kind of trap door in the or anything. Just that, I guess that maybe the paper's gone. What's with this metal barricade? Yeah, same shit, same shit, same shit. Uh, ay, 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 um, when I think about being constantly watching these cameras, it just stresses me out. Honestly, fair. What's that notepad say? Did you write that down? Yeah, you, you should. I don't know why you're not. It's a toolkit. Okay, you don't. When Mondo's coming to fucking break your skull in. Okay, so that's just literally... It's It, it doesn't actually prep, uh, prime you. Look at that fucking chair. Look at that, mm, look at that space saving. Uh, I don't know if this is a normal thing. Like, maybe this is just... In Japan, this is a little bit more normal. But the bed is in the middle of the room. And that's fucking weird. Uh, let's head on the fuck out. It says we should talk to... No, I don't want to leave. I'm going to save. Save before you want to... Always want to save before you enter. If there's one thing Fallout 3 taught me. You save before you go inside something. A building, I mean. In we fucking go. Leave the area. Yes, please. Thank you very much. Um, okay, so we have free time. It really said to, it suggested going to talk to her, but I don't fucking know, man. I think, you know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna talk to Sayaka, and then I'm gonna talk to Kyoko. Oh, uh, actually. Does this count as time? I think it's, I think time only counts as me talking to someone. I fucking hope not. Me going back in and out like this is, is gonna happen. I thought maybe I would, I, I actually, the reason I went in the washroom was because I, yes, the reason I went in the washroom because I was like, maybe I can wash the gold off my hands. All right, well, let's do what the game says. That's never led us astray. I guess I should press the doorbell. Ding fucking dong. Hello? You know, Makoto, I'm so anxious. I really am afraid. Hmm, should I talk to Saika? <laughs> hey, I'm really anxious right now. Would you mind talking to me for a little bit? Yeah, I gotta head out, actually. I'm pretty busy. <laughs> Fucking knocks on their goddamn door. Spend some time with Sayaka, of course. Are you gonna try and cheer me up? Sorry. No, no problem. <laughs> I did my best to comfort Sayaka. Sayaka and I grew a little closer today. Wow, would you like to give Sayaka a present? Uh... Yeah, fuck it, why not? Let's see how this works. Um... Oh, I, I literally just gotta scroll through this motherfucker. I'm double tap. I'm double fisting this thing right now. Double fingering this thing right now. TOS! TOS! Bajobo dolls. Look the Bajobo dolls. Huh? Huh, present for me? I fucking hate Bajobo dolls. I think you can make time for the two of us to talk. What's wrong? Why are you being so formal? I... Well, it's just, I guess it was, that was kind of formal, but. I'm so worried. <laughs> Having you on my side really makes me feel a lot better. Um, if you weren't here with me, I just don't know what I'd do. I'd be lost. That's why. I'd hate that we'd meet again under such awful conditions, but I'm relieved you're with me. Sayaka, standing here face to face and hearing her say that. It's nice, but kind of embarrassing at the same time. I know how you feel. You being here is what saved me. 
Real. Ah! <laughs> uh, thank you for the flattery. That smile, that mysterious smile that softens my heart. I really wasn't flattering her. That smile was. That smile saved me. But it's kind of strange, you know. I never thought I'd get the chance to really talk to you like this. All through middle school, you never talked to me. In fact, you never even looked at me. It's because you're like a celebrity. I couldn't just go around staring at you. Wait, how do you know I never looked at you? Hey, um, because I looked at you all the time. I... I was always looking for an opportunity to talk to you. You wanted to talk but... to me? But since I already had, I always had so many people around me, we ended up graduating without saying a word. That's kind of sad. That was one of my biggest regrets. But why me? Um... Do you remember during our first year of junior high, that huge bird wandered into the school pond? Actually, now that I think about it, I do still remember something like that. It was like out of a fairy tale. The turtle once every the the turtle once every million years. That bird once every thousand. A huge bird wandered into the school pond during our first year of junior high. What kind of a bird should we imagine it as? I'm gonna imagine it as a fucking puffin, and just a really big fucking puffin. Uh, P u f f i n. If you don't know what a puffin is, um, I think it might have been. Oh, okay. I guess we're not gonna fuck. Ah, uh, a heron. I have. We have herons in, in where I live. I guess we have all these. Do we have cranes? Yeah, we do. A huge bird. Herons are big. Cranes are are pretty big as well. I think it's got to be a heron. Herons usually that they don't like to land in water. They walk into the water. So say a heron. It's a heron, wasn't it? And that like a heron, but bigger than it. That'd have to be. Huge bird on the school pond during our first year of junior high. A crane. It just walked right into the pond. Okay. That's right. That's what it was. It was so big the teacher had no idea what to do. I guess I don't know shit about birds then, fuckhead. Sorry. There's something behind you. <laughs> There's something on my camera. It was so big the teacher had no idea what to do. <laughs> but you let it into the forest behind the school. You helped it find its way out. Let it into the for A crane into the forest? Well, only because I was only, I was already in charge of taking care of the animals at school. They made me do it. I should have said thank you then, but is it okay if I do it now? Thank me. I... I'm that crane, you see. I've seen you. Wait. E-Web Fat Rat 123. Thank you very much for following. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Wah! Thanks. Um, we just found out something super fucked up. So that's great. I'm that crane, you see. I've come to return the favor. Here, let me make you a cloak. <laughs> just kidding. Okay. I honestly, though. Honestly, is she, though? Is she, though? It's debatable. What? Yeah, honestly, though, I was so impressed. That's why I always wanted to talk to you just once. I feel uncomfortable talking to her. Um. I, it's like, it's like. She's got all the, she, you know, she's got all the charm and like the, like the, like the, everything to be like, okay. I mean, that's, that's the intention. She's like, you know, oh yeah, I really like this girl, really innocent. But then there's definitely the, the but then there's that fucked up under part where you're kind of like, I don't know if you're going to fuck me up. I never imagined this would be how I got my chance. Um, uh, yeah. If we'd meet again at a train station somewhere downtown, that'd make for a nice dramatic reunion. I just fucking forgot what she said. What was the last thing? That's why I've always wanted to talk to you, even just once. I never imagined this would be how I got my chance. Good stiff. All right. But instead, it's this weird school. Hi. Maybe, but still. Um. Oh, she heard me thinking again. I'm sure you'll help me find my way out. Just like that crane. You'll save me. You see. It's just intuition, I know, but I still believe it. I'm gonna save her. This is that shit. It's like in The Walking Dead when they're like, when they say like, um, like, like this whole shit where it's like, you'll make sure like if you have to choose between me or, or like fucking, God, what the hell was his name? Wasn't it Jimmy? It was Jimmy and fucking, oh God, what the fuck was his name? I played that game so much. Fucking trucker dude, motherfucking has this, has, Kenny, Kenny, holy shit, Kenny or fucking, I can't remember his name, the kid in the in the varsity jacket, and they're like, yeah, you'll choose between us, right, you know what to do when the time comes, I'm always like, please don't put me in these situations, anyway, I'll do my best, I promise that, I'll make sure it's more than just intuition, if there's anything I can do, I'm gonna do it, <laughs> I believe in you, besides, my intuition always turns out to be right, like I'm I said, glad, I'm psychic, 
because I'm psychic. <laughs> kidding, kidding. She laughed out loud as she said it. <laughs> the closer we get, the stronger that smile of hers makes me. I was glad to feel that way. Melodious voice. <laughs> once we all, once we were all done, I headed back to my room for a little while. Oh, that's it. That's all the free time I get. Okay. Heard somebody beep in my house. It's officially goddamn nighttime. <clears throat> this is a school announcement. It is now 10 p.m. As such, it is officially nighttime. Soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked, and entry at that point is strictly prohibited. Okay. Okay then. Sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Good. Today's already come to an end. What a big day, but I swear, tomorrow I'm going to find some kind of clue. I swear! Oh, I'm just going to sleep. Okay, that's it. As my eyes began to slide close, the conversation I'd had with Sayaka that morning began to replay. In a way, it's almost frustrating. Even if I understand where her desperation is coming from, I can't share in it. The pressure she's under is way different from anything a normal high school like me goes through. She didn't just stumble into school the way I did. So I can't say I feel the way I feel things the way she does. Compared to her, no, compared to everyone else here, there's no doubt I just don't match up. <sighs> Shit, man. I guess that might explain my own frustration. <laughs> the duality of this game is fucking... <laughs> Um, so I'm sure that you've noticed the killing game has a gun, but there's still a room for a little laughter. I like the soundtrack. It seems our newest student, already so filled with despair, still have some... Newest students, pardon me. Still have some hope of escape. <laughs> so when will it all begin? Well, when will their hope begin to die? Is it time yet? Is it time? Pounding excitement! And jeez. And jeez. And jeez. And what's the fucking, um... Tom... Tom... Fuck. Tom C. Riley, Guy who did Wreck-It Ralph, I forget his name. I always fuck up his name. Will Ferrell, John C. Riley, Tom C. Riley, holy fuck. Um, he did this fucking skit where he's like, God, he plays, I forget what character he plays, but he's pretty much so like, he's like, ah, more girl, I'm gonna say, we're gonna come to me. I can't, I, you know what, this is a fucking terrible explanation. I'm so sorry that I fucking said any of this. Um, I think it's uh, John, John C. Riley, Adult Swim. I think it's on Adult Swim. It's like he plays this fucked up. Oh, Steve Brule. Steve Brule. Uh, Steve and then B R U L E, I think is how you say. But that's what that uh, reminds me of. Well, I don't even get, remember what I fucking said. All right. That Lind Roller, man, is still there. Good morning, everyone. It is now 7 a.m. and nighttime is officially over. Time to rise and shine. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Get ready to greet another beautiful day. All right. Morning has come. How fucking Chekhovian. What should I do today? Free goddamn time, huh? Did I fuck that up by going to my own room? Probably. Maybe I should take a shit. Got it. I don't think anything else has happened. I do that. I want to do that. Sword's still there. Uh, I don't think there's any coins of any kind. Uh, I'm going to talk to Kyoko. I have some time, so maybe I should take a little rest. No! Fuck no! No! Lint roller. All right, well, let's, you know what? First things, got fucking goddamn first. Uh, we're gonna save this bitch. Just like we're gonna save, uh, what's her nuts? <laughs> Already forgot her name, don't worry. Um, I mean, I'm just looking for coins, essentially. Uh, excuse me, mom. Yes, please. Let's head out. 
Let's check the map. Okay. Toko's in your fucking room. Let's, uh... I guess she's not in her room. Let's kill her. We don't have anything to talk about right now. Well, shit, I would if I fucking could. <laughs> That's fucking horrific. <laughs> this blips out of existence. Uh, I don't feel like talking to anybody else right now. Is this... Oh, is, is there anyone in here? I guess the fuck not. Wait, is that not outside? Oh, that's literally just... Is that a wall? Or is that just actually just a... Oh, well, fuck, who knows? Oh, okay, that's actually the exit. Is this a, the, oh, there's a whole kitchen. Interesting. Let's check those fucking knives out. There's some kitchen knives hanging on the wall. There's a whole bunch of different knives. I had no idea you need so many to cook. Honestly, very fucking true. Security camera, give me that fucking coin, bitch. Give me that coin. Nope, nothing. Check out the fruit. <laughs> Still, I'd rather have some cake. There's so many, I just forgot, I'm not reading any of this. There's so many different kinds and all super healthy, I bet. Still, I'd rather have some cake. I fucking knew it, bitch. I'm gonna buy some more gifts. I have to gift people. This meat. This is one of the monitors Monokuma appears on. Right now, it's just showing a school crash, so I don't think about it. I'm not sure about it. Ugh. It's a deli style display case, all kinds of food and stuff lined up inside. Shit, bitch, I'm fucking rich! I think that's everything we can explore in here. Right, let's get the fuck out of here. One, six knives. There's six knives. Remember that. Um. Anything else important in here? I already found a, a coin behind that thing. Yeah, no, let's, let's let's get let's get 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 away from me. All right. So there's motherfucker McGee right there. Uh, there's God. I forget his fucking name. What does it say when I Leon? Uh. James, if you're watching it, but that's a fucking trigger right now. Um, oh, at the store. I wanted the store. Star, star. Let's head on in, bitch. I want to find uh, fucking Kyoka. Kyoyo. Kyoyo. Kyoya. Kyoya senpai. Um. Okay, he's in the boys' bathroom. Um, that's where I was. Okay, classroom 1B. I want to talk to her. Uh, I want to talk to that motherfucker. Just playing this game past time, probably. Yeah, I would. Let's give it a shot. It goes down a little bit each day, I see. So you can't just spam it. We go down, that's weird. If I just do one, what, what happens? What do we do two? Let's do two points. A fucking bow and arrow? Okay, that's that's great. What is that? I, we'll have to look at all this shit. I might as well just fucking spend all my god. Let's do three. Let's let's. I'm going big. Oh, I I didn't. I actually was might have reconsidered that. Little cute little radio. Good shit. Well, let's get out of here. Hopefully I don't need more. I should probably get going. I should probably get the fuck out of here. Are there any more coins lying around? How long am I going to be stuck here being watched by all these cameras? 
Well, not long if anyone took that fucking toolbox idea. How long am I gonna be without my manga? Yeah, it reminds me of one of those. It reminds me of like a um, London store, like a like a British culture store. I don't know how to, I don't know you describe them. They literally just sell like stuff from the UK. Have you ever had Ribena? Mm, good fucking shit. Just drink it straight. Drink the syrup straight. Not even. I don't. I don't even water with it. I said that shit. Just guzzle her down. All right. It's Chihiro Fujisaki. That's the gym. I'm sorry. Is this? They're not. Oh, they're in the hall. That's what, that's what they mean. That's what they mean. Okay. Does actually? Oh yeah. There's a little bit of a head bob. I like this kind of. It's like this. It's like a light coming down from the. Are they just painted different, or is that like supposed to be like a light or something? A light source. What an interesting, colorful school we have going here. I think that they were. I'm guessing when I won't go in, they're gonna be. 1B. Okay. Well, I'm gonna save that shit. Don't you fucking deny it. That's why they call me Save Scum McGee. Yeah, my process is so powerful, I can save dang Amropa. Like, that doesn't even take any time. All right, it's a clock, but I can't see outside. That's fair. So one of the monitors Monica appears on. Right now, it's just showing the school crest. I don't give a shit about any of this. I just want to see if it's a coin. I never fucking mind. Uh-huh. No, bitch, this fucking nasty fucking blue, blue wall. I really want to smash that camera, but if I break it. That's what we're here for. I wonder if I give it all the coins I have, what happens? Anything over there? I guess I get a video camera at some point. Um, she is thick. Her fucking shadow is just fucking thick as shit. This motherfucker's hair, I love it. Um, all right, let's talk to, the, cause she's like the, she's like the fucking weird one. Who set all this up? And why did they choose us? There's so many mysteries. Hmm, should I talk to Kyoko for a while? Let's go with their instinct. Let's go with their gut. Um, I, I find when I play these kind of games, I'm like, gotta get it right. Gotta get the, the ending where everyone lives. <laughs> because every, otherwise, I'm like, I get so fucking upset. That was like what, what it was like with The Walking Dead, is I was like always constantly just like, I need to do this perfectly. So I'd save, and then I'd actually like go back to different checkpoints and like redo it again to try and get the best ending. But um, we're doing it fucking live, baby. I'm in no position to tell you what to do. You're free to do as you wish, right? But I have my own way of doing things. Didn't see anything to each other. <laughs> Kyoko and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Kyoko a present? I <laughs> should give her the dinosaur outfit. Um, yeah, sure. I f forget what I have. I wish they just, like, I guess it's, I don't know. I wish they just had it. Okay, I didn't want to, because if you do the right click, it, it'll actually give it to her, so I didn't want to do that. Prize problems. These seven important mathematical problems. I don't know if I, I don't, I'm not gonna give her that. I do have two dinosaur. I have none of those. I never had discovered this major. It's fashion from meteorite. They say that's getting pierced by it. Like, give me the power to see demons. So. This is something you don't see too often. I'll take a close look at it. Oh yeah, sure. 
Are you scared, Makoto? Huh? Hey. Being trapped in a place like this. Who who wouldn't be? They Their face her face looks like the same as Sayaka. Sayaka. Like they have the same kind of face. And I'm not just trying to be cheeky. I'm saying like they they actually I'm wondering there's something weird going on with her and I wonder if they're like the same person or something. Like she got like split in two or something. Who who wouldn't be? Of course I'm scared being trapped in this insane Correct. school. Ah, that's good. That's good. So... Fear is proof that your imagination is functioning. Frankly, I feel bad for anyone who can't feel fear. Ooh. Without imagination, you can never choose which action to take next. What about you? You seem totally calm. Wrong. You don't act afraid at all. I'm scared too, of course. I simply hide my emotions. Bottle them down, shove them way down the fucking bottom of my nuts. There's no advantage to be gained from letting others see how you feel. You hide, huh? Oh. What I mean is, I'm not as foolishly open as you are. Foolish, thanks. <laughs> hey, thanks for sharing your vulnerability. That was stupid of you. Listen. Also, the fear I experienced is a little different from yours, I imagine. Huh? What do you mean? So... Ah. You're afraid what might what you might lose, Correct. right? But I'm afraid of what I've already lost. I'm sorry, I don't understand. <laughs> <laughs> I know, buffoon. Baka. <laughs> she didn't bother answering any further. She just turned Goodbye. and nice. With that, she was gone. Well, so just gonna know each other. Maybe we'll talk more next time. I don't think I understand her at all yet. Kyoko's report card. Oh, I should check that out. Your maximum number of skill points has increased. Hey, look at you go. Oh, I got an achievement too. Nice. Head back to my room for a little while. Uh, I'm going to check. Okay. Still got lots of fucking time left. Um, let's check out that report card. Kiyotaka. I do kind of want to talk to Kiyotaka for some reason. Five foot six, 106 pounds. Most people, oh, most people worry about what they may lose in life. She already seems to focus on what she's already lost. Max skill point plus one. The thing I remember about Makoto most in junior high was that when the, that crane got stuck in our school pond, he helped. I think I always wanted a chance to talk to him after that. Melodious voice. Oh, okay, you don't. Um. I want to talk to myself more. Someone's telling me to talk to Kiyotaka. But with that, let's save. Another day in the life here at fucking goddamn murder school. Um. Uh huh, uh huh, uh huh, uh huh. Okay, wait, is no one up here? Oh, okay. Still lots of time left in the day. All right, let's, yeah, let's do that. Uh, let's look at the sword again. I, I wonder if it'll... No, it just fucking gives me the same goddamn prompts. Let's write down some stuff, maybe. Nope, she, she, he don't want to do that. Don't feel like doing that right now. All right. Yeah. Oh, never mind. Okay, we, we, there, are, there are people. It's our fucking friend, Sayaka. Um, where is there one? Okay, dining hall. Kitchen. <laughs> um, boy's bathroom. He's taking a shit. Kyoko. Already talked to her. Toko. Chihiro. Something's telling me to talk to good old goddamn uh, Taka. There, those three doors. Maybe it's because those are the, th the three doors closest to me. There is Mondo's door. Was this terminal one closer to me? But I don't know. Fuck. Let's go in the laundry room and check it out. Oh, they are in the laundry room. Probably to kill time while you're waiting for your laundry. And guess who's on them? Uh, oh god, fucking damn. 
washing machine. That's right. This is the laundry room after all. Do all of them just have fucking that same description? One of them's got to have a coin. Here we go. Um, does that same logic apply to... Yeah, okay, that's... Okay. It's fucked that some of these people are gonna die. Not on my fucking watch, bitch. Not on my fucking watch. Okay, okay. Yeah, what you gonna do? It's a certain skill I have looking for money. Uh, I'm a money goddamn magnet. Lots to look at in here. Surveillance camera. I hate the idea that someone would be watching me. I have to. <laughs> Laundry. Swimsuit hanging out to dry. I wonder whose it is. I mean, I really want it. <laughs> I can fucking guess. Maybe it's the swim champ. I don't know. You fucking sounds so pervy. I don't know. I don't know if that's what his intention was. Erg. All right. Oh, we already looked at the swimsuit. Okay. What the fuck is that? It's always nice to have a drink while your laundry gets done. That's true. I've never, uh, I've never been to a laundry mat before. We're gonna talk to what the fuck is the nuts is. The dining hall. What do they make your character intentionally short to make you feel small? Feel fucking small. You feel fucking small, mate. Oh, you know what? No, I'm going to go down to... Yes, I want to leave the room. And I'm going to go down to the first fucking floor. And... We're going to buy some more shit. I don't know if the... Hi there, Celestine. No time. No time for freaks. I might have to give him those Bajobo dolls to him. I feel like he would have really liked them. He has the beads and all his stuff on his arm. I don't know if that's really any, if that's Buddhist or anything. What's this? What's this? Uh, fuck yeah, I would. How's that repeat doing? Yeah, okay, let's, let's do one coin and see how I go. Fucking goddamn armor. Oh, if you, ah, if you spend more coins, the repeat chance is less. I see. Okay, so that's what that affects. How are we doing? How are we doing? It, it's, I'm literally rolling a 20 right now, essentially. Don't know what that is. I got to repeat when it was like one, so what the fuck am I going to do? A goddamn saber. Let's do one more. I'm pushing this shit hard. Great, we got it all. All right, let's fucking lucky. Oh, you get two things. Oh shit. Okay. All right. Well, shit. Oh, is that? Ah, that's nice. It actually uh, talks about it. Okay. Well, let's get out of here. It's about ten percent chance we'll fuck that shit up. Um, I am gonna look at this. <laughs> Let's, let's, you know what, I love our, our, I love our good fortune, and I am going to save scum. To celebrate, I think I want to save this occasion forever on my disc, at least until I have to overwrite it. Um, let's check out our prezzies. Fresh bindings. They were once commonly used for underwear and bandages. They say when you wrap around yourself, both body and soul become taut. Flex those cheeks. A limited edition shirt featuring legendary punk rocker Jimmy Decay. Only a hundred ever made. Holy shit. Um, who would like that? Um, I figure in the popular TV personality hosted Lost, Lost and Forbidden Love Fantasy Outer Space. I don't know who would enjoy that. Muramasa. The strongest weapon ever made. It's great for dungeon diving and lets you warp through walls. Of course, it doesn't actually exist in this reality, so. I'm holding on to that shit. Um, Millennium Prize problems. That's right. Tips and tips. 
thick book that has hints and codes for every game ever released. A must have for any true gaming fanatic. Someone's graduation album. A Hope's Peak graduation album that someone left behind. The signature pages are all completely blank. <laughs> Relatable. <laughs> Got two of those green fucking costumes. All right, well. Exact. Yes. I thought I heard some getting up the bed. It makes that fucking noise sometimes. It's the Mondo, man. Go fuck yourself. You're probably fine. It's just the first impression. Um, Who do we have down here? They're all just in the hallway. Okay. I guess I could go to the gym. Let's 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 go to the gym. I know you can fast travel, but I actually like walking around. Um, gets me immersed. I guess when the map gets bigger, I'm assuming that's gonna happen. Cruise washroom. Don't do it. Anything new? Doesn't fucking look like it. Let's. Cases and trophies and other items. Well, that's fine. Let's go in the gym. Wow. Oh, <laughs> that's a nice big tree. A television. This is one of the monitors Monokuma appears on. Right now, it's just showing the school crest. I don't even want to think about what am I. Where have I heard that before? Holy fucking shit. Hello? Oh, that's a camera. Oh, it's just, no, it's just on, the, on the floor now. I have to keep in mind. Uh, okay. Well, that was enthralling. Let's get the fuck out of here. I think this probably counts. I think it, I think like this counts as time. Yeah. I want to leave the fucking area. Um, it's in the boys' washroom. Let's head on in. Got these nasty walls. No, there's literally nothing. Okay. Shit. Where does she be? Let's get the fuck out of here. I don't have to shit. Alright, let's head back upstairs. Let's 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 go talk to I'm just following my gut. I'm just gonna go talk to fucking what's his nuts. Um Taka. I'm gonna go talk to Taka. Have my own walk animation. Do it myself. Spare hotel. I like that. Our room's just covered in blood red. <laughs> blood red light. So happy. Um, yeah, yeah Togami. I sing his first name, I always fuck it up. I can't say our current circumstances are favorable, that's for certain. But still, it's times like this when bearing your soul can lead to building a mutual trust. And the best way to bury your soul is to bury your skin. Let's bathe together. Okay. Let's bathe together and bury that trust. Hmm, should I hang out with Taka for a while? Okay, not actually. I'm imagining it that we were both gonna get in like a fucking tub. Um, sure, let's spend some time. <laughs> All right. When the body is naked, so is the soul. So get to stripping down. I'll give him the wraps, actually. Was that part of the music? I thought I heard someone say something. Taka and I buried ourselves to each other in the bathhouse. Ah, your pe your penis, it's this big. Taka and I grew a little closer today. Would you like to give Taka a present? 100%. I'm gonna give him that. Those fucking wraps, motherfucker. Fresh bindings. He wants to use kind of underwear to these. Give. I see. Hmm, maybe I was wrong about you, Makoto. What? Let's continue to deepen our relationship, shall we? Does that mean he liked it? Mm. Hey, Makoto, as long as you're talking, let's really talk. What do you say? Huh? Oh, yeah. All right, sure. Mm. Excellent. You hear me? Then let's get down to brass tacks and find out where we stand and all the big issues. So what should we discuss? Politics, the economy, international affairs? Wait, hold on. Instead of a big, serious discussion, can't we just have a normal conversation? That's basically what we learn about people, I think. 
<laughs> what do you mean by a normal conversation? Um, well, for example, what do you like to do in your spare time? I st study, of course. I'm a student, aren't I? A student must be a studying profession. And of course, my duties as a chairperson of the mor moral moral morals morals committee uh, keep me quite busy as you well. Understand? It's my duty to foster an environment in which we can all focus on our studies. Okay, but what else? Like when you're at home or just have some time to kill. Time to kill? Yeah! If I have time to kill, I study. I see. Haha. <laughs> <laughs> this is fun. Okay, my turn. Makoto, what do you like to do in your spare time? Um, you know, just normal stuff. Watch TV, play video games. Huh. And this helps you study how? <laughs> no, no. It's not about studying. It's just for That's fun, cool. you know? But doing things just for fun serves no purpose. There must be something more to it. You wouldn't spend your valuable time doing something useless, would you? You can insist all he wants, but in the end... But maybe there is is a good reason, like getting into something and talking to people about it. So maybe... Oh, fuck, I forgot what he said. I don't know. So maybe... You know how it's useful? It gives you something to talk about with other people. <laughs> Something to talk about. Like when you see something awesome on TV or some awesome game and you want to share it with someone, you find other people who feel the same way, and that's how you make friends, see? This is ridiculous! I was once blind, but now I see. What the heck? That kind of thing is. Oh my fucking god, the snow! <laughs> Looks like a fucking hentai, honestly. <laughs> I've tried making friends, but whenever I would make conversation, it would die after a few minutes. And now I finally found the answer. I need to study more games, more TV shows. No, no, you don't need to study them. I'm so ashamed of myself. If there was a hole somewhere around here, I'd only go hide in it. I let it get to me. I wasted all that time. I never saw the blind spot in my studies. I'm a complete embarrassment. I'm not going if I'd even be on the morals committee, let alone the leader. I don't think it's really that big of a deal. <laughs> Thank you, Professor Makoto. Professor? Senpai? Wait. Sensei. I don't think I'm, I don't think I'm a senpai. You've taught me a most valuable lesson. You've earned my respect and the title of professor. That's gonna make things super awkward. There's no need to be modest, professor. I can't wait for your next lesson. Until then, I will strive to learn as much as I can on my own. Well then, professor, by your leave. Without waiting for a reply, Taka ran off. Professor, although thinking about it, I didn't totally hate it. Professor Makoto. Taka's report card has been updated based on your experience with them. You just unlocked the skill. Attentive influence. Give yourself a pat on the back. Ha! You've earned it. After we were done, I decided to head back to my room for a while. Do we still have any time? Or is that... that I think it's probably just two people I'm going to guess you can talk to. Let's see. Nighttime. Bing bong. It's fucking night time. So we talked to Kyoko. <laughs> And Taka. This is a school announcement. It is now, as such, it is soon the doors to the dining hall will be locked. An entry at that point. Okay, Strictly then. prohibited. Sweet dreams, everyone. Good night. Sleep tight. Don't let the bed bugs bite. Fuck that up. It smells like someone farted. I didn't actually fart. Uh, the third day has here has already come to an end. Wh when will I? No, we. When are we gonna get out of here? I laid on my bed and stared blankly at the ceiling. Before I knew it, I'd fallen into an uneasy sleep. Okay, okay, I can. Um, fuck it. Let's save. Save now, motherfucker. Um. Report card. Let's get Kiyotaka Ishimaru. Ultimate moral compass. A student must be a study professional. That's my motto. Studying is necessary even to have everyday conversation with other students. Attentive influence. Hmm. I don't know what that fucking means, but we're going to find out. I found, and, and before I knew it, I'd fallen into an uneasy sleep. Here we go. Monokuma Theater. 
in the media. The fast acting picked me up. Uh, if it doesn't act now, it's the same as giving in to regret. What do you think guides the world? Speed, of course. That's why Formula One drivers are so popular. Any idiot can accomplish something if they take it slow. Even the human piece of excrement could create a masterpiece if they spent their entire life on it. Someone who does things in a timely fashion is most wise and admirable. Admirable. Straight is better than a curve or an angle. Freestyle is better than the backstroke or breaststroke. Dive through is better than sit down. A Sunday comic artist is smarter than a graphic novelist. What I'm saying is, speed is the gold standard of the standard world. Which is why I said I need that pick me up. Meanwhile, point zero 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 two sec zero 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 two seconds later. <laughs> Huh? Ah, oh, scratch my eyes. Is this a dating simulator yet, I said? Good morning, everyone! It is now 7 a.m., and nighttime is officially over! Time to rise and shine! Get okay. ready to greet another beautiful day! day. Fan-fucking-tastic. Has someone died yet? I really fucking know. Hope not. Gah. Another night of restless sleep. Day after day, I can feel the fatigue. Fatigue filing up as soon as the thought crossed my mind. Ding dong. The sound of the doorbell forces its way into my room. You know who's going to die? One of the three people I talked to. What's your nuts? It's gonna, like it's going to be one of the three people. Um, oh, I guess Taka and Kyoko aren't important to say anything. Yeah, well, I, okay. Oh, the, door, the doorbell rang. Just an everyday trash can. I can't shit myself. Um, any coins or anything yet? <laughs> you know, I am kind of tired. <laughs> yeah, honestly, relatable. Um, when I think I'm, yeah, put it to an edge. Thank you for being patient with me rechecking all this stuff. I like how the how the old bolts are so oversized. Reminder. What about Monofuka? Monokupa? 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 Mono. Hey. A fantastic morning, isn't it? Uh, it's certainly a Tataka. <laughs> now, pardon the interruption. Without waiting for reply, Taka bars into my room. Um. I really should talk to Taka, shouldn't I? Alright, let's fucking do it. What's up, Taka? No matter how intense the stormy seas may batter me, I will not fall as long as my feet are firmly planted. You agree, right? Uh, I'm not sure I understand. And if you can't do it alone, just find someone to support you, and you can support them back. You hear me? That's how you can overcome any storm. Um. Okay. Hmm. Hmm. I was thinking about it last night, and I decided we really need to come together. And that was when I realized every morning from now on, after the morning announcement, everyone should have breakfast together. Quiet down and and now is the beginning of that fateful day. Please, head to the dining hall at your earliest convenience. This is all for now. I have to go let everyone else know the good news. Taka didn't even wait for a reply. He turned and left before I could say a thing. Before I could tell him how nice he... Well, I guess I better head to the dining hall. Um... Leave the area. Let's leave that fucking area. Alright, uh... Yeah, yeah. Gonna shit my fucking pan. That's the mission area. What about the... I guess I can't go downstairs. It's not gonna let me go downstairs, huh? I guess it won't. It'll probably say like, you know, I really should head to the fucking thing. I don't have any reason to go to school here. I just meet up in the dining hall. <laughs> What's up, Toko? Um, Toko? What's your problem? What? I was wondering what you were doing here. You should probably head to the dining hall, right? I know, I just need to prepare myself mentally. Prepare yourself? What is she talking about? <laughs> ah, I'm so... The giggle? What's she so nervous about? That was a scary little fucking giggle. There's more people. Hey, it's your boy, Leon Kennedy. Hmm. Ah, oh, so freaking tired. Seriously? How's wrong with that guy? Did he wake you up too? Yeah, he sure did. I guess he's going around you know waking up I mean. everyone. 
That's seriously annoying. <laughs> I'm going back to bed. If I don't need to be, I'll be in my room. I don't think I'll do it. It'll do any good. I'm sure he'll just come Give bug you again. Yeah, probably. Damn it. Guess you better just go then. I was wondering. And that's that. I guess if I didn't talk to him, he'd probably go back to his room. <laughs> that's what's up. There he goes. Juko. Hey. Makoto, can't you guys get a freaking clue? Huh? Are you for real? My mascara is totally clumpy. I don't know the pain, honestly. I don't know the pain. I don't want anyone to see me this way, but talk I can't Yeah, what a dick. Ugh. Clumpy. You look just as the same. <laughs> the master of compliments. How are you talking? <laughs> as if it's like night and day. Sorry. Ugh, I seriously need to reapply. There's nothing I can do about it now. Maybe we'll go see if Celeste can hook me up. And that's that. We've been imprisoned here, and that's what she's worried about right now. I get it, man. Clumpy mascara. I don't get it, but I fucking get it. I should have myself. All right, great. Well, we got everyone there. Wait, was that everyone? Let's check the map. Um, yeah, that fucking was. All right, let's let's fucking tear it up. We'll find out what happens in the cafeteria, and then we'll probably call it there if it takes long enough. We'll see. Uh, of course, you always want a golden rule. Save before you enter. Scrabado! There we go. There's a line across my screen right now. Cutting this big sunspot. How fucking dusty it is. God damn. Uh, lots of people to talk to. Leon Kuwata. Uh, who are we gonna talk to? Let's talk to fucking. Let's talk to people who are outside. You know what? I'm gonna talk to you actually. Hmm. Hmm. A little heavy, annoyed sigh. I'd rather be ignored, please. Stuff that kind of insult. Let's just chat with everybody. Yet. Why the Why the fuck not? What's your problem? What's the point of talking to me? Talk as a one who's got to together. Go talk to him. You have questions or whatever. I want to just chat with everybody to see what they say. Mondo. Yeah. Yo, good morning. Oh, this Let's sucks. Just try to get this over with. Talk is getting angsty. Sakura. Hmm. Good morning. Good, good morning. Let's bring everyone together for a breakfast meeting. It's a very Taka-esque suggestion. It truly is. Yo. Morning. Mm. Man, waking up to the sound of Taka squawking is not a fun way to start the day. Uh, Kyoko, how you doing? Hey. Taka looks pretty impatient. We better get this started already. Okie doke. I haven't even mm. talked to you. Good morning. Hifumi, you don't seem too energetic. Very sad. <laughs> How can I be? I got woke up with that annoying, obnoxious, nightmarish guy. That's why I hate 3D so much. Alright. Hey, Makoto. Good morning, Ma... Good, good morning, Makoto. Morning. <laughs> Breakfast time, breakfast time. Gotta eat a big breakfast at breakfast time. It's fucking true. You fucking do, man. Um, Swimmers, too. You definitely gotta eat a lot. Good morning. Good morning, Chihiro. <laughs> it's nice to get to eat with everyone. With so many people, it's actually kind of fun. She gets the dinosaur outfit. She's shy as fuck. I forgot about that. What? What are you looking at me for, Mr. Goody Two? She's running the show for now. <laughs> Celeste. Breakfast meeting, eh? Perhaps it would keep me entertained to make life, everyone, right, life with everyone here a bit more bearable. And of course, we have the main man himself. So we got one, two. Oh, th I haven't talked to. Hi, Makoto. Second. Good morning to you, Makoto. She can make even a basic reading feel eloquent somehow. That's power of a celebrity, I guess. Hey, um. Is everything okay? Oh, yeah. Good morning, Sayaka. Okay. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen. Oh, pff, over there. Fourteen, fifteen. But more important. Okay, okay. I absolutely must talk to you. This is hurry up and start the stupid meeting. Talk is going to throw a fit if we don't. All right. Well, that is fucking that. Listen to me. Looks like everyone's here. So let's begin our very first breakfast meeting. Quiet down and listen. Everyone, thank you for making time and your busy schedules to come together. Give me a break. I didn't make time for this shit. You dragged me here. I know I already mentioned this earlier, but in order to get out of here, it is essential that we all cooperate with each other. And the first step is this breakfast meeting to allow us to become friends and build trust. So from now on, let's all meet here in the dining hall every morning after the morning announcement. Now then, 
Let's eat. You want me to eat breakfast with other p p people? I've never done that b b before. I'm not sure. I mean, seriously? Yeah, it's been a while for me, too. But more important... Well, anyway, did anyone have to come with any clues? Silence echoed throughout the dining hall. Seriously? <laughs> Nothing at all? Hey. Anything. It could be about how to get out or who's doing this. Nobody has anything? Are you okay with this? You are going to die. Huh? Huh? Do you understand? If you can't stop yourself from showing weakness in front of others, you will die. Stop it! What the hell? Don't even freaking joke about that! I am not joking. Adaptability is survivability. Did I not say so? Her, she is Bear Girls. So you sh you'd better hurry up and adapt to your new life what here. What the hell is this? Have you gone completely insane? Adapt to my loot life here. Do you have any idea what you're saying? What? Yeah, sounds what? like the girl wants to live here. And hell, more power to her. But she Piece of shit! No way in hell am I living here. I'm gonna get out of here. I don't give a freaking <laughs> shit. Sure. Feel free. Huh. Uh, okay, so nobody has any clues. What the heck? One thing I can tell you behind, is who's behind all this. Someone who's totally weird and messed up. Why else would we be trapped in here in the first place? Hey, listen. Well, sure, it could be something like that. But for right now, actual clues uh, are... Um, uh, 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 huh? What's up? Um, if you think in terms of people who are really abnormal bizarre, do you think maybe the person responsible for all this could be a certain murderous friend? Fur murderous fiend. A murderous fiend. Shihiro, do you have some idea who might be behind all of this? Maybe, I mean, I can't really be certain, but... Spit it the fuck out! Certainty is not a concern right now. I'll allow whatever remarks you may have. You know? Okay, well, have you guys ever heard of Genocide Jack? <laughs> Genocide Jack. You mean that serial killer that's been in the news and all over the internet? <laughs> the monstrous villain who's murdered scores of victims in brutally bizarre fashion. The word bloodlust was left in each murder scene written in the victim's own blood stand-up guy. Whoever it is, he's like a ghost. He strikes that warning and disappears without a trace. And on the internet, they started calling him, uh, let me guess, PewDiePie. Hmm. Genocide Jack. That about covers it, I think. Definitely fucking wrong. <sighs> they say he's even claimed over a thousand victims. Hmm. That's just an urban legend, though, right? I mean, even like 10 people. I mean, even like 10 people would be totally insane. I don't know. They, they, the numbers get up there. Uh, Toko Fukawa. It's her. <laughs> Anyway, whoever Genocide Jack really is, he's obviously some kind of super crazy killer. And if he really is this ultimate psycho, I wouldn't be surprised if he put together something like this. What? But like I said, I can't be certain. I don't have any evidence or sense to anything. It's just a hey, thought. Hold on. But if they're the killer, isn't that like a killer of a problem for us? Yeah. <laughs> it's okay. Everything absolutely, positively, 100%, without a doubt, going to be okay. Because help's going to be here soon. I'm sure of it. <laughs> Help. We've been stuck in here a few days already, right? Nobody's been able to contact us, so I'm sure they're getting worried. I bet they called the police already. <laughs> We've been placed with like ro We've been replaced with robots. What's this? The police? You're putting your faith in the police? Bastard. What are you doing here? Guys. Seriously, you understand what role the police exist to fill? All they're good for is being a foil, playing against the villain or anti-hero or evil organization. The bad guys come along and destroy them, and that just shows how badass they really are. <laughs> are you really- are you sure you want to rely on such an unrivaled group of losers? I mean, come on, if you really, really want to get out of here, all you gotta do is kill! <laughs> ha 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 ha. What the hell? Why the hell are you laughing, big, 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 big pe pe penis? You know? I'm just impressed with the total commitment of this whole act. He literally does not fucking believe it all. On. You're still going on about that. You're fucking dead. So, Mr. Serial Killer, Psycho Freak Bastard, what the hell do you want? Mr. Serial Killer, Serial Killer, Psycho Freak Bastard, huh? That's a pretty long name. German, maybe? Hey, My name's Oscar Lang, this saw you. I know, I know, just leave me alone. We know who you really are. Hmm. Maybe if I ignore him, he'll just go. You son of a hey, bitch! Hey, don't ignore me, asshole. Mm. Okay, okay, let's get back to business. Your life here has already begun, and a couple days have gone by, and nobody's killing anybody. Mm. I thought all you kids were lazy and selfish, and here you are working together, but I'm totally bored. There's nothing you can say that'll make us start killing each other. I Wait, I think... Yes, ding, ding, ding. I figured it out. I think at the end... Okay, I'm gonna guess what he's gonna do. If we don't kill each other at the end of the day, if someone doesn't kill one person, if we're gonna, it's gonna be randomly selected who fucking dies. That's... 
that is the fucking ticket. Ugh. In other words, all the mystery ingredients are here. Right people, right place. So why hasn't anyone killed? How? Why, how, why hasn't anyone killed anyone yet? That's what I couldn't understand. But I just realized there was one very important piece missing. What? What are you? If you want to know, I'll tell you. It's motive. It's so simple. I just have to give everyone a motive. Stop fucking around. Motive. What the fuck are you talking about? Hey, um, oh, by the way, there's something I want to show you guys. You son of a bitch. Stop changing the gosh dang subject. Hmm. I have a little video I'd like you all to see. Ooh, oh, but don't worry. Exciting. It's not some pervy adult video or anything. Seriously, it's nothing like that. It's a special video for each of you showing what's going on outside the school. Outside the school? What are you talking Hell. about? <laughs> Oh, Master's, Master's so impatient today. Why don't you just watch it and find out? Here in the school, there's a specific place you can go that has everything you need to watch the video. Good, then we can go watch the video right now. Before we do that, I'd like to know, what are you? Why would you do something like this? What do you want from us? What do I want from you? Well, if you must know. Despair, that's all. Well now. If you want to know more than that, you'll have to figure it out for yourselves. Do whatever you need to uncover the mystery hidden within the school. I won't try and stop you. Because <laughs> to be honest, it's entertaining as a heck of watching you guys search so desperately for answers. <laughs> so I guess I want amusement from you too. Okay, well, fantastic. He's gone. And once again, he left before we could find out anything useful. Is that right? Really? I think we learned something very useful. He has no intention of standing in the way of our pursuit of the truth. However. Interesting. Perhaps, but what about the video he mentioned? I'm very curious to see what's on it. That's true. Same here. Okay, so, Mondo started glancing around the dining hall. But when his gaze landed on me, he stopped. Hell yeah. Hey, Makoto, check this out for you. Check this out for us, would you? Huh? Why me? Because no. you're close to the door. That's the rule, right? R rule. Jesus Christ. Hey, hey, hey. hey. Hey, 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 hey! Piece of shit! Hey. Stop fucking around. You see how passionately I'm begging you? What's the big deal? Just check it out real quick. Okay, I guess I'll get going yeah. then. Awesome, thanks. I owe you one. Hey, um... If Dakota's going, I'm going with him. It's not safe to walk on this place Yo. alone. Probably is actually safer. Because everyone here is trying to murder each other. Yeah, sure thing. Then we're counting on the both of you. If anything happens, just yell and I'll come running. That's um. sus. I can't decide if Modo, Mondo is totally dependable or completely terrible. Yeah, I'd have to say he's kind of both. Except without the dependable part. He's not exactly a bad person, but I definitely can't say he's a good person either. So then where's the specific place Monokuma mentioned? It must be somewhere you can watch DVDs, but DVDs. I wonder like if you're watching this video in five years, how much that'll date this. Not a Blu-ray, a USB? It's places to set up uh, to watch DVDs, then. Audio video. Audio fucking video club. Uh, first of all, has the report card for anybody been updated? Let's see if Mondo. Biker gang leader. Not that big. I mean, he's, he's actually, he's pretty lanky. 168. Maybe not. It's probably mostly muscle. Anyway, uh, I'm going to save. Boop, 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 boop. Save. Save that shit. Going down there. Yes, ma'am. Thank you very much. Um, can I go back in? There's no point going back in here. Uh, let's check out the mappy poo. Did anyone leave? No, they're, they're not down there. Okay. Well, down we fucking go. Do you want to go? Let's go to Sakaya's room. Sakaya. Hmm. That's. Can I change the music? I'm just wondering why it says background music in the background. Like. Oh. Oh yeah. You're, you're right. <laughs> you definitely can't fucking watch it in here. Okay. Sounds good. Um. Well, let's go downstairs. Let's go downstairs. And maybe I'll leave you all on a cliffhanger. Sorry. What are you doing at this... <sighs> Makoto Naegi, do you mind telling me what you're doing at this high school? Sir. For a blick, he flew pretty good. <laughs> For 
for a, a yeah, that's right. Not B R I C K, B L I C K, because I can't fucking talk. Um. All right, you know what? I will leave us on a suspenseful note for today. You can yell and scream at the fucking computer all you want. If I triggered you today, comment free free download video dot com and link it to like some random fucking website, and then uh, I'll report you and get you fucking come, uh, uh, reported. <laughs> Good one. All right, let's save down here. I'm literally just, I'm gonna save just over top of the last one I did. Daytime. Oh, so it's not morning anymore. Okay. Well, uh, yeah. Okay, so that's uh, fucking uh, dang and dang and propa. Dang and dang and dang ass propane. That's more. We're playing some trick or happy havoc. Dang ass propane. And um, yeah, I'm I actually I'm really enjoying this game so far. So uh, I hope you guys are too. And uh, it's kind of nice actually to, to read all this stuff out. I think it helps me. Uh, I want I, I do like voice acting, so it's kind of nice to um, try some some sillier voices out and try to imitate these guys. But we'll see what fucking happens. We got a lot of gifts. I don't know who we're gonna talk to next. I'm thinking Chi Chihiro, Chi Chihiro, Chihiro, Chi Hero, Chi Hero. Yeah, I forget if that's her full name. But I think we're gonna talk to her. Give her that dinosaur costume. Um, Something's kind of giving my instinct about that, but I don't. I don't really know. I'll probably feel different next time we come back to it. But, um, yeah. So if you watch this on YouTube, thank you for checking it out. Uh, I hope that you are having a good day. My face is hidden behind the. I think yeah, you can see me like this. All right, you're looking at me like this now. But um, yeah. Hope you're having a good day. And uh, that's all I got to fucking say. Anyway, all right. I'll see you later. Bye bye. Thank you for watching. Have a good rest of your day. Farewell.